हेलो गाइस हाय एवरीवन वेलकम टू लीड इलेक्ट्रिकल एकेडमी माय सेल्फ जी श्रीकांत आई एम परसिंग पीएचडी इन उस्मानिया यूनिवर्सिटी हाय एवरीवन हेलो गाइस हियर माय सेल्फ श्रीकांत गंजी टुडे आई विल टीच ट्रांसफार्मर्स दैट इज देयर इन पीडब्ल्यू सब्जेक्ट बेसिक इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग सब्जेक्ट फॉर सीएससी स्टूडेंट्स आईटी स्टूडेंट्स एंड ट्रिपल ई फर्स्ट ईयर्स and ec first years so this is a chapter number 3 transformer so first of all what is transformer in this transformer we have all these contents what is meant by transformer and the next one is principle of operation of transformer principle of operation of transformer then we will discuss about constructional details of constructional details of so practical transformer so construction details of practical transformer and after that two types of transformers are there that is core type of transformer and shell type of transformer and one more thing is also there that is berry type but is uh, that is not at all important core type and shell type of transformers so t by f means transformer so next one is emf equation of transformer emf equation of transformer so this is most important for j and h point of view so this is repeated so many times so he may be ask there are the emf equation of a single phase transformer and one problem this emf equation may be he will ask for eight marks and problem on emf equation the problem on emf equation he may ask for some marks i think you know this lockdown pattern so out of eight questions you should write five questions 5 into 15 that should be equal to 75 marks yes this is about the lockdown pattern lockdown pattern of any subject but before lockdown and maybe it will be implemented future so first question is 25 marks we have a a b c d like that e f up to e f we have 25 marks and these questions are compulsory and 2 3 4 5 okay 2 3 4 5 6 and 7 8 and uh, second question you may have 10 marks and third question is also 10 marks and fourth question is 10 marks and fifth question is also 10 marks in this second question a or b is given either you can write a or b and here also you can write a or b and here also you can write a or b like that you can write you can write it so generally some questions will given we will see the question paper pattern later so the coming to this concept the emf equation of a single phase transformer the emf equation of single phase transformer so eight marks will gives for the derivation and seven marks for the problem and after that we will discuss about ideal and uh, practical transformer ideal and practical transformer so then we will discuss about equivalent circuit of so equivalent circuit before that equivalent resistance 
when referred to so primary and secondary also secondary of single phase transformer and after that we consider the equivalent leakage reactance leakage reactance when refer to primary and secondary of single phase transformer so after that exact equivalent circuit we will draw exact equivalent circuit exact equivalent circuit of single phase transformer so moreover we will discuss losses in a transformer while we, while we discuss the resistance and leakage reactance and when the transformer is operating under no load condition during that condition we will discuss in a losses in a transformer there are two major losses in a transformer that is iron loss and one more loss is called the copper loss iron loss we can say that it is a constant loss we will discuss why it is called as a constant loss and uh, copper loss is also called as is called as copper loss is called as variable losses and then we can go for the voltage regulation of voltage regulation of single phase transformer voltage regulation of single phase transformer and after that we will discuss efficiency of single phase transformer efficiency of single phase transformer in the last year question paper is given as open circuit test so this is beyond the syllabus but we will discuss open circuit test and short circuit test of a single phase transformer these are the contents we have see if you observe the syllabus only is mentioned ideal and practical transformer and equivalent circuit losses in a transformer and regulation and efficiency so up to this is a depend the single phase transformer and the next concept is auto transformer next concept is auto transformer auto transformer so why we use auto transformer what are the applications of auto transformer we'll discuss and the last one is three phase transformer connections so three phase transformer connection this may be star by star and delta by delta star by delta and delta by star transformer so this is about the introduction to the single phase transformer and what are the contents are there in a transformer we will discuss one by one in the next video so thank you students Thank you.